Day one, race three at the Cheltenham Festival, the 2.30, the Ultima Handicap Chase, three mile one, grade three, class one, five-year-olds and upwards, £46,500 on offer to the winner. We've lost Lieutenant Rocco, who's found to be lame in his box on Saturday. He's a real... Uh, sad one to see out of this race. I fancied him strongly for Nick Mitchell, but instead we're going to go for I Wright, who's another very progressive eight-year-old chaser, trained in the north by Harriet Graham, has won one from seven over fences, gradually improving run to run since getting off the mark at Newcastle in January last year. Not disgraced at Cheltenham in the RSA when fifth behind Champ. So he's got a bit of track experience over this kind of trip. He ran really well at Newbury on the 28th of November when second behind Cloth Cap. That form's been well franked since. And his latest run at Doncaster came in the very valuable Skybet handicap chase behind taking risks with Captain Order close up third. I think that's pretty good form. He'll love the better ground at the festival. If you look back to his hurdling wins, uh, he was a five-time winner over hurdles and three of those came on really good ground. He's a strong traveller a sound jumper he has edged up the weights but I think he'll go really close here he's around about a 6 or 7 to 1 chance with bet 365 I think that's an extremely fair price and the other one I was keen on is Sipage of Venetia Williams who's another one who comes here at the top of his game he shapes as though this big field will suit him um, he's pretty exposed four from 19 over fences but he ran really well in fourth behind secret investor last time out and this sort of stamina test should suit him ideally he's got loads of good Cheltenham form in the book